Hello. Uh, very good evening to all. Um, I'm Dr. N.V. Dandavani. Today, uh, I would like to share with you regarding uh, the concept about uh, <coughs> drawings, particularly engineering drawings, or uh, it is also called as a manufacturing drawings. Okay. So before going to discussing about uh, uh, what is meant by the drawing and what is the, the purpose of drawings, just a, just uh, I'll give a brief idea about uh, what is the purpose of drawing. So the mainly drawing is used for uh, communicating or interact between the designer with other departments like production department or inspection department or quality department something like that in mechanical manufacturing industries okay so <coughs> the detailed uh, description or the detailed uh, uh, concept about uh, your uh, drawings will explain about engineering drawings right so this drawing which consists of the complete uh, data like uh, the entire uh, layout and uh, the bill of material then the title block title block is very very important because any drawing if you are going to create so the complete history of that particular component or the drawing whatever which is uh, present in the uh, uh, like the sheet okay so this uh, title block which consists of like uh, uh, the name of the drawing and uh, drawing number surface finishing heat treatment process what is the heat treatment process is used if required and uh, the angle of projection that's very very important for that first angle projection or uh, uh, third angle projection then um, the name of the component and what type of tolerance we are going to use in this particular drawings and so on right so these including weight also these details which comes under uh, like the title block right and apart from this title block see any drawing let us see that this is the uh, like one simple drawing it's like a support it's like a roller support so this drawing which consists of the detailed view at least minimum two views is required to uh, describe all the details so the view which consists of like say for example if you take this is your front view and this is your top view and this may be your uh, cut section or view so the cut sections is like you can see that the H with your mark this is your cut section you are going to see the the what is the internal uh, cross section should be like that okay so that is the purpose you are going to see that cut sectional view and you can see the front and top view here you can see all the details like uh, linear dimensions angular dimensions and uh, uh, like uh, even if you have uh, the circle so the circle which consists of what is the diameter of the circle or the diameter and the depth what is the depth like maybe sometimes it is uh, to the particular extent or sometimes throughout the whole what should be and uh, what is the like bolt uh, will be going on in this particular hole so you can see that here you make it this particular uh, circle so the total number of circles may be one two three four with the diameter of 10.20 it is uh, like a through hole the entire depth of the hole will be produced apart from this you are going to use that uh, uh, like the bolt is nothing but m12 all we know that m12 is nothing but metric uh, the bolt is 12 mm the basic diameter and 6 mm height through right and the six I'm sorry six mm not six mm height it is six hole through six H, right and uh, another views like you can see that because this particular uh, uh, roller support which con consists of there are many component it, around the total it is six components are there right so all the six component which comes under in this particular assembly line so each and every individual component we are going to see the front and top you say for example if you take this is your first block so first block name it is uh, like here it is mentioned the total number of holes is also mentioned here and if you take uh, like the second block is this one so the second drawing is you can see here and this is your structure in the second uh, uh, drawing here we have uh, like uh, all the three views front view top view and side view so all the three views which uh, consists of the detailed dimensions like uh, linear and angular dimensions and uh, radius also which is included to the sum to the certain extent we can include your diameter and uh, what is the type of uh, bolt we are going to use okay so these details 
is rec mainly required for manufacturing this particular type of components suppose if you want to add or if you want to include the standard components like bolt nut washer and stud all those things you can directly include the uh, like no need of doing the drawings because already it's a predefined or it's a standards it's a, it's is it's already available in your uh, data sheets or data book something like that directly you can call it as a uh, standards then you can use for assemble this particular entire geometry and the next one is <clears throat> um, you can see here this is your uh, the part number is five so the part number five is nothing but the uh, like bush so this bush which consists of the total dimension is 80 mm and from this end up to this point there is a dimension then the whole dimension all those things are available so the basically if you want to manufacture this particular component the minimum dimensions is required for manufacturing this particular part is all the horizontal dimension and the vertical dimension with like uh, diameter and also some reference dimensions is required for manufacturing this particular component and when we are going to assemble all those component and we need the reference uh, planes or reference uh, dimensions right so that is also required for assembled this all this component okay so entire uh, dimensions everything which is comes under millimeter so whatever the dimension is represented here it is in it is in millimeters right this is mainly for assembled this particular uh, components and uh, say for example if you take uh, uh, the component number four it's it's a name is shaft okay so the shaft is mainly used for uh, okay uh, the base is this one and bracket the shaft is item number five this is your shaft and uh, this four is nothing but bush so this bush will be located both the sides left side as well as in your right side okay so you can mention here the total number of number of quantities for the bushes two right so the two number of bushes will be located in left side as well as in right side to hold this particular uh, pulley or the roller okay so that should be uh, the basic idea about uh, the drawings and uh, apart from this the overall uh, view about the drawing it's like this we need the bill of material this is nothing but the bluff material it is only the limited number of items will be presented here it is item number and part number and this is the quality it is also including the weight and what type of material is required for this particular component and uh, where it is located that which means the location the part number and name of the part and if uh, you want to add the standards standard component also you have to mention here so all those things which comes under the bill of material okay uh, so some places you can see that uh, uh, there it is mentioning like uh, say for example if you take this is your uh, diameter of the hole and uh, the total number of holes should be 4 into the radius of 12 mm through right only that much would be mentioned here you can see that it's a through two hole means the total dips and some places here it is not mentioned nowhere it's like a typical suppose say for example if you take this is your draw, radius r <coughs> r is this this arc radius will be 12 mm right similarly same arc radius should be located in here also so for that reason we need to provide something called something called typical typ so here it is not mentioned actually you should mention the typical means both the uh, that arc should be similar same radius so that way we have to include on that type okay uh, generally for uh, manufacturing industry this type of drawing is mandatory so the drawing which consists of almost all the title block bill of materials and the dimensional details to the some places you can make some notes like uh, if you are uh, using any standard component or sometimes you are using a uh, uh, like uh, 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 other uh, painting and other uh, material properties uh, hardening or uh, some other uh, mechanical properties if you want to add you can make a note of that and mention here so that is the the complete drawing about your uh, manufacturing of a component so this is mandatory for almost all the production industries okay why it is required for 
all the places because the drawing generally in engineering we studied it is in communicating language like that right so communicating to whom normally as a design engineer is going to do uh, this particular production drawing sir but the drawing should be uh, uh, like uh, going to the production department or the inspection department so the production department is going to see that all the details and dimensions all those things including material then based on that he is going to manufacture it once the manufacturing part is completed the same drawing will be uh, moving towards the purchase department for purchasing the component and the same component uh, i mean same drawing should be moving towards the inspection or qc because after completion of your production process or manufacturing process we need to check the dimensions and other parameters for that reason the drawing is required for the inspection department then once this the process should be completed everything then finally you can arrive the the shape and size of si the shape and size of the product should be fulfill your customers so this is a way to read the drawings and this is a way you can assemble the drawings and for uh, this minimum or the basic information should be required for the drawings so that is the uh, the main motto of this video i think uh, uh, a certain extent i can explain about uh, these drawings you can understand or you can uh, get an idea about uh, this uh, drawing reading something so if you have uh, any uh, like further information or something like that definitely we will see in the next video thank you